brand new day and we have something crazy planned. We are going shopping for our barn and we're taking Toby. No, we're not taking Toby, but Toby has a trick and we're gonna show you. If you guys are just tuning in now, you might not know that oh. <laughs> Toby is one of our three chihuahuas. He's the smallest of our chihuahuas. He's just a little over two pounds. He is a rescue and he is my little dog. Anyways, Toby is so small he can't get off the couch. He can't get on the couch. He can't get on the bed. He can't get off the bed. Toby, you're ignoring them. Look, show them how cute you are. Anyway, today we discovered a magic trick that Toby can do. He kept it a secret from us all this no, time. No, we knew from the old house. Okay, so here it is. But first. Okay, yeah. Okay, just ah. for some comparison, this is how tiny Toby is. Show them next to Cookie. Next to Cookie. No, you have to pick them up and show them because you can't see. So basically, a t a Cookie is five pounds and Toby is two pounds. You can tell just by the size of their head how tawny he is. Macy is three pounds. Macy is three pounds and Toby is two pounds. Okay, let's do it. Show a Toby's magic trick. He's still in my pajamas. Yeah, Gabby's still in her pajamas. For this shirt. Yeah, she's my waiting. pants are in the dryer. And yeah, they're soaking wet and yeah. I can't. It's yeah. bothering me being in my pajamas. Okay, let's do it. All right, Toby, go. Toby has a belly band, and that is just in case. Woo! Uh, that belly band is specifically in case he decides to spray something and mark his territory because he is not neutered and he's not neutered because he has a little bit of health issues. He is a rescue and we love him so much and we would rather keep our stuff safe. Um, and he doesn't mark too much, but he does on occasion. So we just keep our stuff safe and we keep him happy and moving around the house um, with a belly band on. Today we are headed on a road trip though. We're going far for what so we're gonna boring. get. The girls have downloaded movies onto their phones so that they can watch I them. I downloaded too much movies because uh, it said you can't download any more movies because you downloaded, like there's no more space, so. So you have lots of movies to watch then. Anyways, it's true, we are going to buy, like one of the big things that I've been wanting to buy uh, for our farm like we're gonna go like we're getting the stuff just like we're getting the stuff the stuff that we need and I'm excited like I'm excited we're gonna take you guys with us and show you we're what we're getting way. yeah we're going to Toronto we're like doing an hour drive yeah yeah we're going for a really long ride drive but I mean this is it's the only place we can get it Better also school, but I want to play SSO before we leave okay well hurry up get done here I know I am Anyway, yeah, I'm so excited. Also, today is Friday. Friday is treat day, and Kaylee is selling chocolates for her fundraising. So we all bought a chocolate Never last mind. night, and today we're all gonna have it. But oh, I'm not gonna have mind. it. Where are yours? Put them in my purse so we can take them with us. Oh, mine's already packed. Oh, in my bag. yeah. So we bought them to support Kaylee, and I'm not gonna eat mine. Caramel world. We're bringing a couple of these. No, one treat. One treat. No, it's this for the road. Nope. Right. It's barbecue. barbecue. One treat. You can have that one next Friday. We're supporting but, Kaylee. Why didn't she sell these? Uh, because she's grade eight trip. They go on trips. Yeah, they go on trips. You want to go to school? No. You could go on a trip with your whole class. No. Yeah. We are going on a trip with my whole class today. Yeah. We're eating sandwiches on the bus and we have heated seats. Yeah. We're taking the truck. Yeah. And we are going on a trip with our friends because we are going camping this year, you guys. We are going back to Horse Country Campground. We are on the, this close to booking it. We picked our dates. We just have to make sure that all of the people that are coming with us can uh, do those dates. And, and I might have a new horse by then. Yeah, and it's not gonna be the Halflinger because I thought about okay. it and I got videos and I tried, like, Halflingers are so cool, but I, we're not getting them. Toby has such a tiny, tiny, small size, and you guys know chihuahuas always want to be warm. We have these little vents in inside our kitchen, and they're really warm. Yesterday, um, this vent was open. We didn't have that piece of wood there. It was just an open vent. And 
And Toby tries to go all the way underneath it because it's warm. It was so cool. That's he what tried to climb. Like he, the only thing that was stopping him was that little belly band around his waist was making him too big. But he was burrowing down in the vent. He would have got stuck in there, and we would have had to phone some kind of person to come and rip him out of there. But so Sam put vents on there today. Thank goodness. Oh my gosh, this is my favorite store on the face of the earth and it took us a farm to get me to go get Laura here shopping. It's true, this is Sam's favorite store, but this store has something that I want. For the first time in 49 years, it has something that I want. All right, Gabby's looking for a broom. Shovels. Shovels. Actually, we need a shovel, but not that kind. Because you know how you clean up horse poop with shovels? My favorite part of the store. Wrong one. This is girls. All right, let's go find dad and the aisle we need. Gabby and I have no idea where we're going. Sam always disappears whenever he brings me to the store. I hate this store. Like look, I don't even know what this is for. But it would be good there's for a horse. There's mostly men here. Yeah, there's mostly men here. This is a man's that store. That could be good to But go. they have something we need. In fact, one of our subscribers and actually a friend suggested this to us. I just asked one of the people who work here where the thing is that we want. And he said, oh, we don't sell those at this time of the year. And I'm like, wow, that's crazy. I can't even believe that. That's for guns, Gabby. Okay, this is the worst store ever. The thing, the thing that Sam came to get, the thing that Sam came to get, they only have one and you have to order it online. That's what you should get. It actually get. don't. All right, so because what if- like better, and you can still attach it to your tractor. So can you pull it like a wagon? You pull it like a wagon and then you can attach it to your lawn tractor if you have a lawn tractor. Can you attach it to your tractor? Too big for that. All right, so but this is what you need because you'll be pulling it, right? So basically, what I came here for was like a heavy-duty wagon, one that you can like drive with your fingers because it's kind of like motorized almost. But um, oh, yeah, that's... that's better. I don't know. So is this what is this good for? Is this good for like hay? For anything, newer hay. Woods. All right, so I guess that's what we're gonna get. It's a, it's a poly yard dump cart. So. Um, that's what we're gonna get. I'm excited. It's like our first it's a like gorilla cart. It's a gorilla cart. You think it's worth? You think that's what we need? Oh, look how wide the, the thing is. Oh no, that's so wide. Yeah. It's do you think wide. it'll fit in our barn? All right. Should we do it? Yeah. Is it on sale? Yeah, two forty nine. So it's fifty dollars cheaper. I say we do it. All right. Oh, you can try and order that one online. But... No, I, I'll get this. Same price as the one that you want. Yeah, let's do it. Dad made me go where the tractor parts are. The tractor parts are? We went to the bathroom. Do you have to go to the bathroom? Did you have fun in the tractor part? This is not my favorite store. Do you like this store? Wow, what is that? A heated pet bowl. A heated pet bowl? So they got like heated water buckets here. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, like that's a perfect size for Stella and a little friend in a in a field. in our field. A smart man will always get his wife and his daughters interested in the stuff inside the store so he can look around more. So this is not the one that we got. How come this one's so much cheaper? Be our guest, coffee, free coffee in the store. I just changed all my opinion of it. So this one's not a dump one, is that why it's so cheap? It's a dump part. So this is, this is what we're gonna be using you guys to uh, muck stalls. 
But look, does that look like it would fit through our barn? Like that's really wide. This is where you really need to get a motorized. Do you think that's gonna fit through our barn though? Yeah, look, it's got traps. Mom, it's the second time that he's this done one that. Drives by yourself. <laughs> and then you What's can dump your stuff. That's two thousand dollars. <laughs> Okay, so that purchase might not seem like a big deal to you, but that's like how we're gonna muck our horses' stalls as Sam drives over a curb. Back we're about to pop, we're about to drop. <laughs> so happens when you have a four-wheel drive, they always wanna go over every Truck curb that they can big. find. Yeah, like they just wanna drive to the parking spot. Anyway, so now we're gonna go to Ikea because it's near us, and usually Ikea is really far from us, so we're gonna check that place out and see what they have. I'm excited, like one tiny step closer to bring in Stella home. That is cute. Mom, it would Two be of good these. for what, like a tack locker. Yeah, oh, that yeah, would be a good tack, tack locker. locker. Yeah, that's a cheap tack locker. So comment below, would you buy a tack locker at Ikea? <laughs> yeah. That is, oh, that is what we need, you guys. It's got drawers, you could put your tack and stuff in. I mean, I don't know how you'd screw. You like it? Look, there's a little bathroom. This would be in it. for like polos and saddle pads. My saddle pads have used saddle pads. I like it actually. I've seen barns with that stuff. It's 15% off, a thousand. I like it. We could all have one. It's nice. I want the red hand. Yeah, I love this apartment, you guys. Like, it's got a little table area. I got an idea. I want to move now. Let's do a overnight challenge in IKEA. Oh my god, that would be amazing. <laughs> we got a stove and everything here. You like that couch, Sylvia? Come on, let's go. Now. Got a desk right behind it. Little area for kids to play. It's so super cute. I like these. They're adorable. Okay, so we are now lost in IKEA. This is what Lost looks like in Ikea. This is the worst idea. This was the worst idea. I cannot shop in chaos. And Ikea is chaos. Let's go to Ikea. I always say that. I want to go to Ikea. And then we go here and I'm like, this is the stupidest idea. Because literally it's so busy and so chaotic like I found pillows that I want to buy so bad and then you have to see them on display here and then you have to walk around and find them then you have to go back to the display and make sure they're the right size and then you have to find the covers that go over like it's just so much work to go shopping at Ikea I am like I'm a Walmart girl you guys like yeah that's me I Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.